space coconut. Madam Preschool. Okay, so we're going to do something a little bit different today. I'm actually going to do some commentary on a match I had earlier today, and we're going to talk about some of the decisions that I made uh, throughout this thing. When I play Hag, um, there are a lot of times where I'm not talking and I'm strictly thinking about um, you know, the future. I'm thinking about, you know, what needs to happen um, in, in, in the future of the match. So as we go along here, uh, from here on out, uh, I'm just going to talk about what I'm thinking and uh, you know, my thought process behind placing traps and going where I'm going. So I'm expecting them to come back, right? So I place that trap. This one, I like trapping people inside the basement here. It's one of my favorite tactics, especially since we already heard her working on the gen down here. We got somebody down. We know somebody's up above triggering traps. And then this is me being dumb. They set another trap, so whoever is there is running to the next gen. They want to get as far away as possible. I'm going to get her out of here, put a trap on. And then I hear the gen to the right. I'm going to use pop to kill it. Fang runs away. I'm going to kill it with pop and trap the same pathway that she used to escape the first time. Chances are she's going to escape again the same way. Of course, I'm going to trap this side of the pallet because this is an escape path through that uh, that basement. Now we're going to see if we can't find Fang. So I gave up uh, going in for the rescue, I'm assuming, or somebody working on the gen. Got our hit, got our stack. We're going to replace this trap. And then we're going to go looking for Fang. Now we're going to go over there. Get our, get our token. And we won't tunnel. We'll go ahead and not tunnel for some reason. She might have had borrowed, who knows. She's heading towards our trap, so that's going to be good. We know what's going to happen here. Got our token. Break the pallet. Reset the trap. We're going to kill that gen further with Pop again, since we're here. And it might kill the gen completely. There's two traps that are really close together, but it shouldn't be too much of a problem. <clears throat> it's still dying, so I can look for another gen. I'm going to trap this pallet. I hear it going, so I do want to kill it. But I think I want to trap any exits. Just in case. I hear her running. There she goes. I'm going to get in a free hit. It is my obsession, so I shouldn't have done this. I should have just let her run and kill the uh, gen. But now she's going down there towards the other... Trap? Did I place a trap at the other side? I do not remember. I might have. I didn't. So we might be able to get her here. Oh, she messed up. So we're going to kill the gen. And then get her onto a hook. And then have up. And then have pop up again. But because of what happened this time, I'm going to set traps. She's setting off traps so we know they're open. I forgot that I teleported. Going for the rescue, we're gonna hit the pop, uh, get the... Oh, I don't have pop. What am I doing? Okay. Oh, we see Fang, we're just gonna chase her, I guess. Oh, that's right, we can leave the obsession on the ground because we're using knockout and we don't... They're not gonna have any idea where she's at. We're just going to reset this and let her go through because she's going up to the top for... Yeah. Mm. And I made a wrong read here. The uh, There was no exit, so I'm going to be looping. I'm, I'm missing out on this now, so she's going to go into the building. I just played bad here. <clears throat> I got lucky and she just ran. So we're going to leave her down. Oh, no, we're not. We're going to hook her. Because they're going to be finding the obsession here pretty soon. We may as well get Pop going again. She's on the hook. Somebody's down. Somebody else is looking for the obsession. We have Pop again and we can kill some gens. 
None of these are, um, none of these are traps, so we may as well. Our obsession got up, so we can, I think at this point I'm just going to, oh. Oh, she, she messed up. So she's just going to go to the shack. I'm expecting her to, at least, so I'm going to set a trap here. That was my bad. I totally didn't expect her to come out. She just ran all crazy, so... There's Nancy. Let's stop the rescue. We're going to get some uh, stacks on Save the Best for Last. Three tokens. Not bad. I don't have a plan at this point. I'm just going to look for some injured people. So now Feng's uh, injured. She's going to be close by. I forgot about Dead Hard. But thankfully she doesn't know how to look where she's going. The rescue's going to happen. We're going to go ahead and kill that Jen. We see Kate, and for some reason she doesn't think I saw her. May as well pretend like we didn't. Yeah, now she knows. Hmm. I think that was a bad... Oh, somebody's still here. Hello. So you're going down again. It's been long enough so I don't have to worry about decisive. Load up pop again. Oh, she's dead. Okay. This got a lot easier. We're gonna kill any gens that might, they might be working on. We're gonna clear any paths. They're telling us where they are. I have six traps, which means I need to set some more. Everybody's healed to full, so that's another thing. Setting off the traps in the bottom, in the basement of the uh, school. She ran to the right. You could tell that by the phantasm that was turning. I still want to use pop, though. May as well trap the building since we're here, but they haven't worked on any of the gens, so the only gen they might be working on is the one in the preschool, so I'm not sure why I'm going this way. So don't be dumb like me. If a trap gets set somewhere, it set off somewhere, go to it. I'm not sh I'm honestly not sure what I'm thinking here, but maybe if they clear out that gen, I can do a three gen strat over here. Maybe that's what I'm thinking. Who knows? But it feels like I'm being an idiot right now. I guess we're trapping loops around the, uh, in this area where we're expecting to have an end game, so. They're working on this gen. The one in the basement of the school should still be going. Nobody's hiding, we may as well move on. They like running from the spot, so that'll help us catch up if they dash from it. Yeah, I should have come here sooner. But, hello. We're at a full eight stacks and save the best for last. We don't have to chase her because they're working on the gen downstairs, but we're going to trap them down there. Hmm. So I don't know where she's at, but I'm going to wait for her to go back onto the gen. Both exits are trapped. There she is. I probably could have grabbed her, but she didn't drop the pallet. Easy. Now we're going to get her on the hook, we're going to load up pop, and we're going to hit the, the uh, generator in the basement. We're also pretty far away from everything else, so they're going to have to travel quite a ways to get her. We can also reset the tra the trap that, uh... Never mind, I guess I'm not gonna... Oh, of course this gen. 
Never mind, they were on her already. Oh, she's greedy. And we got her. So, that was just luck on my part. If I had hesitated at all by setting the trap like I thought, this wouldn't have happened. So, we got her down. We get to pop this nearly finished generator. And we know two of them, the other two, are over, are over here somewhere. Fat shame. I think that gen is still regressing. We're gonna... Oh. rescue. Now the uh, obsession should be going for the rescue. Thank you. And she kept running, okay. We might be able to cut her off or catch the rescue. This was a mistake. Now we'll kill her off. She's gonna use Decisive in her next match. That gen is still regressing. We're gonna set up some more traps since this building is now a death trap. Well, we should. Anyways. She ran downstairs so we can do the same thing as we did before. Trap both sides. Hello. She's like, oh, we can leave her down and look for Fang. This might take a while. Or not nearly as long as I thought. It's too bad I didn't get that hit. She's right outside. And honestly, she lost me really good. I heard her in the grass, but I, I had no idea where she went at this point. I was really, really impressed with where she, how she vanished. Because I know I heard her in the grass. And then she was just gone. So I don't know. Maybe she went around the corner and back downstairs. But yeah, it was impressive. And then that's when I realized that she got past me somehow. Yeah, but they're both downstairs. She's getting killed. And we're on the wrong side. But... The trap is up there, so we can get another one. We do want Fang down, actually. This is the fourth time she's used this escape path, so we want to keep that trap up. Thankfully, she's injured, so she's easier to track. And instead of going around, she decided to go forward. Now that she's far away, she's far away from Nia, she's in the opposite corner. We'll be able to slug her once we get her. We'll leave her here and go look for Nia. We only have two traps in our pocket. We only have two traps in our pocket. Most of the pathways are covered. Um, so there's a good chance that she'll pop a trap. Ah! And that's game. With Fang down, all I need... Ah! I don't even need to worry about outsmarting her. I just need to chase her. Like a silly little hag. But she is going straight towards the shack, so it makes me wonder how she knows where, uh where Fang is. But it doesn't matter. And then that was the match.
I'm not sure if it made a lot of sense with where I was placing crap traps and <laughs> where I was <coughs> where I was placing craps. But uh, yeah, as you can see, I don't really think that far ahead as to where the survivors are. But I think about where they're going to be instead. And then every trap I place is where I'm going to be in the future. And this turned into a perfect game. But, you know, we can blame it on the ranks, whatever, but it, it, it's still, you're still playing the same way. So I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know if you liked me talking about what I'm thinking during these as a extra commentary and uh, I'll do it again sometime. Until then, I'll see you in the fog. <laughs>